What is it? Put it down, please put it down. Okay, okay. I need to destroy that. Hey yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy and welcome back to another video. Today's a very special one because we're doing some more Pokemon cards, but we've got a big announcement and this time we're buying Pokemon cards on Wish. So let's go shopping. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for some shopping on Wish. I know you guys love when we do this, so we're back on Wish.com looking for something different. We're looking for Pokemon cards today, ladies and gentlemen. And while I search up some Pokemon cards, I need to tell you something, okay? If you haven't seen on already your boy made his very own pokemon card store that's right it's called copped cards Com. I did it with the homie Chad with the J. If you're an OG, you remember me and Jad go way, way back. So we launched this store a couple weeks ago. Shout out to everyone who's been supporting so far. But basically, to give you a quick summary, let me just go to copcards.com. Show you guys what we're working with. So basically, we sell Pokemon cards. We're going to also be selling sports cards and stuff down the road. But the really cool thing about this is we sell live breaks. So as you guys can see here, we got this live break section. Then down below, we've got sealed products. So if you want sealed product, you can get it from us. But if you want to participate in our live break sessions where we live stream and open your cards for you with the rest of the community and send you out the cards that you get from your pack be sure to come check out copcards.com we stream over on jad's gaming channel right now youtube.com slash chad with the j games i'm gonna put a link to that in the description down below so even if you don't want to cop some cards at least come through hang out with us but if you do we really appreciate it as we start off this new venture but with that being said let's let's head back over to wish okay and see what kind of pokemon card options we can get on wish are they real are they fake how do they compare to cop cards obviously not as good but maybe still kind of good i don't know we'll find out we're also going to be making some content over on the cop cards youtube channel so be sure to follow us on there be sure to follow us on instagram i'm going to be putting links to all that stuff in the description down below and look at that boom pokemon cards just right right in our face oh wait that's because we searched it so that's that makes sense that's why it's right in our face <laughs> shining fate oh it's a bunch of different a box of different cards okay get some champions path i'm trying to get that charizard you know add that to the card 26 bucks for a booster box is pretty good <laughs> now let me know in the comments before we do the unboxing do you think these are gonna be real or fake i have my suspicion uh, let's get an evolution box oh these are going for a lot so i'm gonna go out on a limb and say these are probably not real i do really want to find some real ones i think that would be super cool but i don't know if that's gonna happen 74 dollars for one no i'm not i'm that that i'm not doing oh look at this evo box this they're really trying to make it look legit so this i think is a real one right here this is what you get which looks pretty similar but not identical i'm gonna add this to cart i probably won't buy two of these but i'll decide down the road either way i'm, I'm filling up the cart with all the pokemon cards right now what is, what is this some top loaders that could be kind of interesting but that's not that's not exactly what we came here for what do we have here come on i want to find one that's real looking pokemon card nine piece so maybe that's like one pack why why not why not let's switch it up i think we got a bunch of booster boxes oh shop pokemon what's in here oh oh booster original but these are in french but it's verified so it's one pack for eight dollars and fifty cents we got a noctail ex which is again french 221 dollars for some Pikachu sandals? So at most, we can get a pack, but none of them seem to be in English. They're all French packs, but we'll we'll buy one. See if it comes. I don't know what's going to happen with any of these. You never know, folks. You never know, but we'll buy one. Maybe it'll be real. I have hopes that it will be real, but I don't know. I don't know. So it looks like it, you got a smorgasbord to select from in terms of what appears to be knockoff Pokemon products, which is really, if I mean, if you're shopping on Wish, like that's probably what you're looking for. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna shop around a little bit more, see what else we can find. There's quite a selection of, of stuff. It's just probably not gonna be real, but it's gonna be interesting to see how the fakes look. Are they good? Is it believable? Is it not believable? I don't know, but we're gonna find out together very shortly because I'm done shopping. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the Pokemon card from Wish have arrived, but I've mixed in some actual Pokemon cards just to see if we can fool Jay, because Jay doesn't really know too much about Pokemon I don't, cards. I don't know. What's the best Pokemon card, Jay? Charizard. Okay, there you go. You know a little something. He's no, learning. It's because, it's because he's talking about it. I've seen you with it. You're like, you like <laughs> I have a minor obsession, okay? <laughs> Don't judge me, all right? Everybody has their advice. But we've got a bunch of products here. I'm really excited to see if any of these are one real. And if they're not real, they're fake. Like, how good is the fake? I'm just, overall, I'm very excited. So if you guys want to see more Pokemon card content, be sure to smash the like button. Also, go over to my gaming channel. Also, check out Chad with the J Games for the cop card streams, like I mentioned earlier. And go to copcards.com if you want to get yourself some Pokemon cards, okay? I know that's a lot. Let's get into the unboxing. Okay, what do we have here? Dragon Majesty, Pokemon.com. 
come. The Pokemon come. Okay, I need to search. Is Dragon Majesty even a Pokemon card? Okay, it is. This is legit. I'm gonna be really excited. So there's our booster box. Let's see what these packs look like. Oh, 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 not promising. We've got some packs that are already ripping off. So I don't know if these are resealed. Let's take a closer look at the pack. Crimson Chaos. I mean, like it's clearly fake. It doesn't feel like it has as many cards as it's supposed to have inside it. It could be resealed with real cards or it could be absolutely fake cards or these could be completely made up packs. You guys want to see me open all of these over on my gaming channel? Let me know because we're going to have a lot of packs today that we could open just for fun. Oh, okay. Off the bat, folks. Take a close look there. Let me know what you think. Are these real or are they fake? Here is the top card. Salandit, Feebas, Dratini, Quagsire. We got a Salamance GX Rainbow and a Giratina EX. In a normal pack, this would be a great pack, but these are fake as hell. 100% certified fake. You can tell by the colors on the back. Well, you can tell. Yes. So it's not good. It's not good, no. What we're looking for is something very close to the real thing real or thing. real thing. I would love if you could actually buy real Pokemon cards. on. There's Wish. no way you can buy real Pokemon cards you... on Wish for a cheap price. The, well, the price of these is not that cheap. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like cheap-ish. I can't remember exactly how much we paid for these, but I, I do think it was cheaper than what you would normally pay. But yeah, these are definitely fake as hell. Nobody who knows Pokemon cards would buy these and not think that they're fake. But this is definitely something I would have used to scam other kids when I was in like grade <laughs> six. Let me see how I'll feel like seeing it. Oh, Charza. Oh my God. Tarzard, Tarzard, that's, not, that's not Charizard, that's Dragonite. It's yellow, what the hell? Leave me alone. I'll definitely think this is real. Yeah, exactly. So you can still you get, get your scam on a little bit. Here, I'll, uh, we need to get you a real card. I know I'm old. Calm down. Oh no, it's definitely fake. Even even the printing tells you so. Yeah, you could just it, it feels very laminated yeah. too. By the way, I'm just curious. Have, do the people know how old you actually are? No. They don't. We guys comment down below. I want to see if you guys can guess how old Jay actually is. So I'm my, really interested most to see. Most of them don't even come close. That's the funny thing. True. Comment how old you think I am and comment how old you think Jay is. Okay, so we opened our first box, and that's so great, but we've got more. We've got more. Let's see what else we got. Next! Fight them! <laughs> <laughs> Throwing a Pokeball? <laughs> That was good, that was good. So, we have an XY Evolutions box from Wish and an XY Evolutions box that is real. We're gonna see if Jay can spot it and if you guys can spot it at home, okay? So, here are the two boxes. Ah, I know the fake one already. Which one's the fake one? This one's the fake one? You are correct. That was fast. It's pretty obvious, but this is cool. We got an XY Evolutions. Just comparing the two, you can see it looks like they just bump up the vibrance. That's basically the only difference. It's the same stuff, but we do have this. Jay, do you know how much this is? So that what? Not close. Up? 400? 600? 800? At that, no, you're kidding. Around probably 1200, I would guess. What? Yeah, for this bad boy right here. I bought these for 500. I was interested to see how this turned out because people do a lot of fake boxes. They sell them online and then uh, basically scam people with, you know, fake cards and all that stuff. So I was curious how it would turn out. I don't think anyone would believe that this was real. So not that anyone should be trying to scam anyone, but uh, Wish would definitely not be a good option if you're looking for real looking boxes. But let's open it. The pack art isn't even the same. Okay, so pack art's not the same at all. I'm not opening opening that X5 Evolutions box, but let's see what we have in here. I'm guessing this is gonna be the same kind of vibe. Oh my God, they, so normally the cards all go the same direction. One is not, so it's like a sandwich. And the top card is the rare, which is a Mega Slowbro EX. Ratata. you also get a Venusaur EX and a, a Caterpie EX, but it's a Charizard, but they call it a Caterpie. Oh God, this is bad. The only thing that's kind of nice about these, it is Evolution card, so it is still a little bit fun to open them and it costs way less, but obviously you're not getting anything real that is worth any kind of value. It's just fun to open packs. And I'm gonna open another one. Let's see if we can get like an actual banger. Ooh, a reverse hollow Gyarados. Oh, Dragonite X. I don't know what that means. Oh, that's a banger. That's oh, actually a really good card. I had one of those and then I lost it. Got another Venusaur EX, a full art Misty's Determination and a Gyarados. If these were real, these would be God packs. This is kind of fun. It's still kind of fun to get good stuff. Oh, we got a Mega Blastoise EX. We got a full art Machamp break and a Mega Charizard EX. Imagine getting a pack of this. Oh my god. That would be insane. It's kind of fun just opening these to see what kind of crazy shit we get. Again, if you guys want to see me open the rest of these, we could do that on the gaming channel. That'd be kind of fun. But so far, 0 for 2. It's not looking good. Okay, but we still have more. I really had hope that one of them was going to be legit. By the way, guys, if you want to get real cards, just a quick reminder, go to copcards.com. What is this booster box? It's not looking promising again, folks. What is this? Pokemon Shield. <laughs> 
It's just called Pokemon Shield. This Evolutions box was at least kind of similar, but uh, this one is, I don't know what this is based off of. I think it's based off Darkness Ablaze from the background, but okay, let's see. What do we have? Oh my God, Rebel Clash. Oh, that's what they're saying. This is a Rebel Clash booster box, but it doesn't say Rebel Clash anywhere on the booster box. We got another L here, folks, but let's just see. They're all base. Oh, these ones look even worse. We got a Grimshar. Grim Snarl V Max. Oh my god, bangers! Blood Pack Central, Malamar V, Bolton V, Lapras V, and Dragapult V. If you could get packs like this, oh my god, that's wild. This one so far has the best hits. It's easy to get good hits when you got fake cards though. Bang, more hits. Malamar V, Galarian Surfetch, Stone Journer V Max, and a Dragapult V Max. Um, what else do we have though? We're not done, folks. We still have more. Oh, okay, this one's not Pokemon. We got Yu Gi Oh, baby. Do you even know what that is. Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, Loki was so good. I loved Yu-Gi-Oh! cards too when I was a kid. I haven't opened Yu-Gi-Oh! in a really long time, but it says 1996 Kazuki Takashi, one rare card in every pack, English first edition. I mean, I'm sure we'll be able to tell if this is real or not pretty easily. Here are the packs. Yeah, these are fake too. These are first editions though. Yeah, I can just tell. And guess what? We got hits coming. <laughs> oh, never mind. Not a crazy amount of hits. It is one rare. It just starts with the rare. Monster Reborn. I remember that card. First of the Dragons. I want to get like a nice blue eyes. I actually want to open all of these, even though there's no value in them, just to get the artwork from the original rare cards that I, I remember in some of these. I don't even know if there's a blue eyes in this, but it's still fun to get a hit of a card you want, even though you get so many hits and they're all fake. It's, I don't know. I'm still kind of enjoying this. So hopefully you guys are too. Smash the like button if you are, but we're still not done. We got more Pokemon cards, okay? This is a heavy one. Oh, okay. This is kind of wavy. So on cop cards, obviously you guys know. I mentioned it like six times already. When we open breaks, you put your good cards into a penny sleeve and a top loader before we send them off because obviously we want to make sure those good cards stay safe and sound on their journey to you. So we bought some samples because we might be making our own cop cards branded top loaders and penny sleeves that will be available for you guys to purchase. This gives us a chance to check them out. So we got a hundred penny sleeves here. This is kind of exciting. This is part of the business side of things. I know it's not exactly what uh, you might've came here for, but still cool. Let me know if you guys enjoy this stuff. You know, when we're talking about the business journey. I mean, it seems to do the trick. It's very simple. Yeah, this could be cool. I'm gonna, let me know what you guys think. Would you cop some cop cards, penny sleeves, and top loader sleeves that were custom branded? I feel like that would be a vibe. Okay, this penny sleeve's looking nice and clean. Bam! Oh, protect your bangers, even if they're fake. Okay, so that's a little added benefit for today's video. Not really what we were initially looking for, but we can protect our fake cards. And if we do get a real card, we can protect it. Jay's probably about to fall asleep over here. Is this not the most exciting video you've yeah. ever participated <laughs> yeah, in? Yeah, yeah. You know what's good though? What? After I whooped you so hard in the Price is Right challenge the last game, I think I think you needed a break. If we did it again right now, I just and I just destroyed you again, I'd start to feel bad. So this is good. It's like a reset for us. Yo, just mouth, mouthing up and down. And when we get to the Price is Right now, damn it! <laughs> what? Next item. All right, we got a Japanese set here. I think this is the Venusaur Battle Box. Now we do have the real version of this on cop cards. So if you guys want to cop that. Go cop it. Oh, this is not what I was expecting to get. <laughs> There's no cards. Normally it comes with packs. There's no packs. Like we have two VMAX promo cards. I think this is like a play mat so you can play the game. And then we do have a stack of cards on the back here. Yeah, those are cards, no, no. Yeah, but they're not in a pack. This is the closest looking to real. Still don't think it is. I actually haven't opened many Japanese cards. I don't have a good baseline to compare it to. I'm gonna just go out on a limb and assume they're fake, but this is the best one I've seen so far. If these are fake, they're very good fakes. This is kind of wavy. What the hell? I gotta protect these with my cop cards penny sleeve. You never know, just in case. Yeah, they're definitely fake. I think it's just this full artwork is very well done, but I'm pretty sure these are fake. Like 95% sure they're fake as well. They're just they're just definitely the best ones. Uh, kind of unfortunate that it didn't come with any packs though. That would have made it a little bit easier for me to tell if it was fake or not. Like this has some value to it because it has like damage counters, does have the um, coin there, and it comes with this mat, which are all useful things if you actually play Pokemon. Oh, this is wavy. What the, f that's sick. Okay, so you have your deck, your side, your battlefield here. Like this is a whole mat for actually playing the game. I don't, I've never played the game. Wait, what? I mean, kind of. Like when I was really young, I played a couple times, but it was always really more about collecting for me. Yeah, I'm curious if you guys are 
into Pokemon cards. Do you play the game or do you just collect? Let me know in the comment section down below. This was definitely the best thing we've had so far. The cards at least can almost pass as real. It comes with some added value that doesn't need to be real. You know what I mean? Okay. What is that? This is my hope for the only real item we have today, folks. Oh, it doesn't feel good. Yo! That's definitely fake. We got something like this in our one of our Amazon return palettes. So I guess you don't have to get them off Wish if you want some fake cards. But it says new cards on it, which I've never seen this being sold from Pokemon. But again, they use the logo everywhere. So I'm someone's getting ready for a lawsuit. Oh, look at the bangers. Primal Grudon. Oh, it's bangers. Banger. Oh my God. Fake or not, once you see bangers, you go off. If these were real, I'd be losing my shit. So it's still kind of fun, but obviously way better when you're buying the real thing and you get the real card. It's just that achievement. Like I got it. I secured the bag or I secured the card. You know what I mean? But these are our cards from Wish and we have one more left. Boom. Okay, this one looks real. This one might be real. Let's open this up. This is Shining Fates. This is one of the new sets available on cop cards right now. Oh, this one's definitely real. Oh, baby. So you can see, look at the difference. Look at the difference right here. Clearly there's, it's like a, you know, those, those like arts alligator not, uh, scissors. That's what they use to cut the top of it. So the real thing obviously doesn't have that. These ones are smaller as well. We're going to open one of these packs, but Jay was able to spot it, which is good. Cause uh, this is real. This is from my own collection. <laughs> I pretended it wasn't. Did you, did you know? Yeah, we weren't able to get anything real from Wish. I searched hard and I, I was hopeful that something would turn out. Nothing did. Either way, we're going to open up a real pack right now. Maybe we're gonna get some heat. You guys wanna see me open more packs? Check out Itchy Games. Again, check out Chad with the J Games. If you're into Pokemon, you wanna see people open packs. Here's a little code card for you guys. You can just feel the difference. Like, look, one is like the, the fake ones are a little more faded, but you can just feel, feel the quality difference. You know what I mean? Let's see what we get. Rotom, Eldegoth, Tropius, Spinarak, Sphinx, Horsey, Ganma, Orpeko, Cagnia, and hey, we got it in DDV. Oh, it's four from the back. That's pretty good. We actually got one real, good card that I'm gonna put in this sleeve and protect it. Considering we opened one back, that's actually really good. Not bad. Uh, overall, what did we learn today? Do no, not buy no. your Pokemon cards on Wish. Unless you just want to have fun. True. If you got a little bit of money to spare and you just want to get only fake bangers, Wish is your spot. It's great for that. If you want real cards, topcards.com, ladies and gentlemen. But either way, it was kind of a fun little experiment to try out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to subscribe if you're new. Again, links to everything I talked about in the description down below. Be sure to check out these two videos if you want to watch something else. As always, thank you so much for watching and we will catch you next time. Toodles!